agreed that you need a wall until I wanted it. Once I wanted it, they didn't agree. With negotiations reportedly at a standstill, House Republicans are saying members shouldn't expect any new votes this week. Okay, Dana, I want to start with some of the human impact of this, because we now know hundreds of thousands of federal workers having to work without getting paid. You and I have both been federal government employees, as has Morgan. Um, There are real people who are impacted by this. Right. So, um, however, I do think that this could go on for a very long time. Uh, Mark Meadows, a congressman from North Carolina, part of the head of the Freedom Caucus, um, was on with CNN and Dana Bash earlier and saying that he talked to President Trump and this could go on for a long time. And in fact, I have a theory. Okay. I think it could go on until the State of the Union. Oh, Why? That usually happens towards the end of the month. Remember right. yesterday like in Iraq when President Trump made his yep. um, uh, secret trip over there that we're going to talk about in, later in the show. And one of the things he said in the Q&A with the reporters is that he plans to go see the border. And then he was going to go see the border and take the press with them. And he said, I think I'm going to go right before the State of the Union. Mm. And I think that it could go on that long because the president is going to dig in his heels. And I, I, I'm not saying I, I don't know anything. This is purely right. my Your thought theory. process. But I'm just thinking if it goes to next week, right, and Nancy Pelosi then presumably she becomes a Speaker of the House. Um, you, then you're at January 6th, okay? So then January 27th, 28th, whenever the State of the Union is, I could see it lasting that long. I so think it goes longer than that. Well, but here's really? the, here, let yeah. me ask you a, a, no a, a practical question. <laughs> Nancy Pelosi, when she takes over and House Democrats are in charge, they will have the votes to pass a clean funding bill. It very well may pass the Senate as well, even despite Republicans picking up more votes. If President Trump vetoes that, is that a good idea? Do you think that's what he'll do? That seems like a bigger political gamble. He doesn't have any choice. If he doesn't Why? deliver on this piece of his promises from the last campaign, he doesn't win 2020, period. The- yeah. That's the only reason why the, the president was prepared to cave last week. There was multiple reports of it. He was bringing everybody in. And the moment everyone started attacking him in his base, it was the first time I ever seen the president fearful because all there is loyal supporters. And so the president realizes this is the gamble right now. Either this is the last time he can get it passed. And so he has to hold a firm stance on this or he won't get reelected. I disagree, but I'll let everybody talk and then I'll take that on. <laughs> well, Tom, his poll numbers have already started to go down a little bit. And the promise, to be fair, during the campaign was that not that taxpayers would pay for it, that Mexico would pay for it. What's your take on this? that? Mexico's got, you know, Democrats saying, well, we'll wait for Mexico to pay for it. That's a loser argument. But they he also, said it. He did the, say it. He did say so it. So what? It doesn't matter. Oh, we, okay. the, 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 the base didn't believe it anyway. They knew he was going <laughs> to yeah. get the money other <laughs> it's way. True. It's true. Listen, I, when I do I, my, you know, talk radio, you know, the callers come in. They yes. all say, look, we knew he was going to find other ways for Mexico to pay for it. We knew he had the NAFTA thing. We knew they want construction to start on the wall. He's right. What he just said, that clip we played, he said Democrats already voted for this. Yep. They said they wanted they, they want a border barrier, right? Remember, it was in 2006. Democrats did vote. Obama did vote. Uh, the uh, Schumer, I believe, voted for the fencing. Mm-hmm. That's why the president is changing. He's saying, look, I'll take it if they want to call it fencing, if they want to call it steel slats. He just wants it. Yes. And he's right. That clip he showed, 